Residents in Eva Beach are trying to save a very successful anti-crime program. Now they say it has improved their community, but they're afraid they may lose it now because some of the funding could be cut. KITV's Dick Algeyer reports from Eva Beach. The program is called Weed and Seed. Just like when you whack down the weeds and grow clean green grass, the program gets criminals and drug dealers out of parks and neighborhoods, and this park is one of the program's success stories. It went from uh, a lot of graffiti, a lot of uh, you know social issues with homeless and uh, drug use and gambling, including daytime prostitution, to what you see it now. And what you see is kids playing. The drug users and criminals are gone. The community has taken the park back. We just, just won a national award that, that said that we're one of the best weed and seed programs in the entire nation. And so uh, we're so proud of that. The Weed and Seed program shares office space with the Halepono Boys and Girls Club. Kids are encouraged to take part in healthy, wholesome activities. Longtime residents say the Weed and Seed program really cleaned up the community. I wish that every neighborhood could have the same opportunity to get their neighborhood back as we did. We can see the difference. Longtime residents tell us that they can see the difference. It's like, it's like night and day, and we really don't want to lose that. But EVA residents fear they may lose it. They say the program may disappear because of lack of funding. So they're holding an event this weekend to raise the money themselves to keep it alive. The fundraiser to get the money to save the weed and seed program will be held this Saturday all day at the EVA Beach Shopping Center. These people really want to save that program. Dick Allgaier, KITV4, Island Television News. You can donate to the EVA Weed and Seed program by way of the Eva Beach Lions Club, and we have put their address up on our website, thehawaiichannel.com. Just click on As Seen on KITV.